Neural networks are an amazing thing. You can teach a machine to learn itself and therefore kind of have this cool creation ability in front of you. Um, but one researcher by the name of Janelle Shane is uh, typically a research scientist, but in her spare time she likes to do weird things with neural networks, including one in which she created some Pokemon, which um, sounded great. There's one called Tyrakine, and its ability is beak eye. <laughs> but she's also created a neural network that learns to make recipes, foods for us humans to eat normally and enjoy as delicious nourishment, except um, it turned out kind of weird. Here's um, some of her best. Beef soup with swamp beef and cheese, BC mist, crim grunk, garlic cleese, star with an asterisk, chocolate pickle sauce, salmon beef style, chicken bottom, cover meats, out of meat, completely meat circle, completely meat chocolate pie, uh, crock pot cold water, and artichoke gelatin dogs, which does sound like something that existed in the 1960s. Um, so I, the, she has, she's got hundreds of pages of these uh, after uh, teaching the well, feeding the neural network um, various cookbooks. Maybe that last one I said did come from the 1960s, and uh, it came up with some weird shit that we probably wouldn't like to eat. We've talked about machine learning before to do more of the artistic and poetic sides of life, like writing songs that turned out to be incredibly creepy and unsettling to people. Uh, go back and watch that nerd alert video. Um, it was recently also shared by IT expert Justin Warren, and here is a recipe in full. Bake until juice, brush with the potato sauce, lightly butter into the vicin, cook combined water, source 0 0.25 seconds, transfer a median in orange cinnamon with electrase, if the baste, make drained off tala willy or chicken to well. Sprinkle over skin greased with a boiling bowl. Toast with bread spit crease. Um, so it's not quite there yet. Perhaps some more information is needed and context and taste and basic flow of how um, foods should sound. But it's pretty fun. You can check it out on her Tumblr page. She's got I don't know, many, many more terrible examples of foodstuffs. Would you eat crock pot cold water or hot ham water? Which is best, the one created by writers or the computer? It's pretty close, everyone. Let us know below and please like and subscribe for more.